Matthew chapter 15, verse 13. Matthew chapter 15, verse 13. The Bible says, But he answered and said, Every plant which my heavenly Father had not planted shall be rooted up in Jesus' name. In the book of Mark chapter 11, verse 23, Mark chapter 11, verse 23, the Bible says, For verily I say unto you, that whosoever shall say unto this mountain, Be thou removed, and be thou cast into the sea, and shall not doubt in his heart, but shall believe that those things which he said shall come to pass, he shall have whatsoever he said. Praise the Lord. Close your eyes. Take this prophetic declaration. Say, I shall not die, but live longer to declare the works of, of my God in the name of Jesus. Say, I shall not die, but live longer to declare the works of my God. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Welcome to Evangelist Joshua TV, a TV show dedicated for dreams, interpretation, and warfare prayers. I'm Evangelist Joshua Oreke, broadcasting from Lagos, Nigeria. If you are not yet subscribed to this channel, Evangelist Joshua TV and Evangelist Joshua Animals TV, kindly subscribe. You'll be notified of all my videos. Today's topic, we are going into warfare prayers today. Today's topic is prayer to destroy the roots of cancer. Prayer to destroy the roots of cancer. Brethren across the world, this particular prayer is not for those who are currently battling with cancer. It's for everybody. I pray that the, the, hand, the, the plans of the enemy will never cut us unaware in the name of Jesus Christ. Because so many people might have cancer in their life, in their body. They may not know. So the reason behind these prayers is for us to, you know, to counsel the plans of the wicked concerning our life. So today we are going to, you know, we are going into warfare prayer. By the grace of God, there are powerful prayers, healing prayers against, healing prayers against cancer. So we are going to destroy the root of cancer. <laughs> the prayer have done so many, have done, the prayers have produced so many testimonies and miracles. And I pray. This prayer shall heal you. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Brethren across the world, cancer is a deadly virus. Cancer is a disease that is of no respect of anybody. It's a big disease that has no effective remedy. By the grace of God, we are going to pray against cancer. These prayers are powerfully organized by the Holy Spirit. They are not only for those who are currently battling with cancer, but everyone who wants to stay free from, from this disease in the future. By the grace of God, we will use prayer to destroy both the physical and spiritual cancer that is threatening the life of so many children of God today. The Bible says, any plant or any cancer which the Lord has not planted in your life shall be rooted up according to Matthew chapter 15 verse 13. Every cancer in your life, present cancer, future cancer, Father will destroy it in Jesus' name. Perhaps you are wondering the early signs of cancer. Perhaps you are wondering, you are, you are, you are thinking, what are the early signs of cancer? Me, I don't know the early signs of cancer. You can go online. Most times, those who have cancer may not have immediate signs or may not even know that they have cancer until they do a thorough medical checkup. Unfortunately, a lot of people have died or died through cancer. Many begin, many begin to wonder if this is a natural, this, many begin to wonder if this is natural or spiritual attack. I want to let you know that cancer is a spiritual arrow fire into people's life. This arrow can be projected through eating food in the dream or drinking water in the dream. If you think your loved one is currently battling with any kinds of cancer, breast cancer, brain cancer, throat cancer, stomach cancer, any type of cancer, today is going to be their healing from that illness in Jesus' name. In Mark chapter 11 verse 23, Mark chapter 11 verse 23, the Bible says, you shall say to that cancer, be thou removed, be thou paralyzed, 
be thou destroyed. The Bible says, those decree shall come to pass in Jesus' name. If there's any person sending arrows of cancer into your body or the body of your children, shall backfire in Jesus' name. So by the grace of God, we are having section one, section two, and section three. Section one, they are all each each prayers. It is prayers. Each session, it's prayers. It is session, it's prayers. So our confession Bible verse is taken from the book of Psalm chapter 6, verse 2. Oh Lord, have mercy upon me. My bone is weak. Psalm 6, verse 2. Praise and worship for 15 minutes. Instruction. If you know that you have cancer or you want to stand in garb of someone, kindly embark on 30 days food fasting from 6 a.m. to 3 p.m. Break that fast with food. Please, I want you to take this prayer point. So this prayer point, they are not ordinary. They are powerful prayer points. If you can take the prayer point, I'm telling you something is going on in your body, internally. You will see what God will do. Just release your faith and you will see what God will do in your life. Don't worry. If there's anyone that is battling with cancer in your family or anywhere or your loved ones battling with cancer, don't worry. The Lord will do it. Just believe. Bring out water. Bring out fresh water. Bring out fresh water. You decree. Matthew chapter 15 verse 13 to that water and Mark chapter 11 verse 23 to that water and drink it. Don't worry. Believe. It shall be removed. It shall be paralyzed and be destroyed in Jesus' name. Close your eyes. Take section 1 loud and clear. Say every evil growth in my life dry up by fire in the name of Jesus. Every evil growth in my life dry up by fire. Dry up by fire. Every evil growth in my body dry up by fire. Every evil growth in my body, dry up by fire. Every evil growth in my body, dry up by fire. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Prayer point number two. Take this prayer point with understanding. Say, you, the symptoms of cancer, eating in any of my body, dry up and die. Dry up and die. You, the symptoms of cancer, eating in any areas of my body, dry up and die. Dry up and die. Dry up and die. Dry up and die, dry up and die, dry up and die, dry up and die, dry up and die. In Jesus' name they have dried up. Amen. Prayer number three. Say every evil food causing cancer in my body. Dry up from your roots. Dry up from your roots. Every evil food causing cancer in my body. Dry up from your roots. 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 That is it. That is it. That is it. The difference is taking place. Dry up from your roots. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. If I'm too fast, you can pause the video or you can screenshot the prayer. You can screenshot the video so that you can have time to take this prayer upon. And it will be very fast because of time. Because this prayer, they are very, very, they are very, very powerful. Prayer upon number four. The arrow of untimely death. My life is not your candidate. Die in the name of Jesus. Arrows of untimely death. My life is not your candidate. Die in the name of Jesus. 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 In Jesus' name, they are dead. Amen. Prayer number five. You mention the name of that cancer. Whether it's the cancer of the breast, cancer of the eye, cancer of any kind. Say, you cancer. Hear the word of the Lord. Be uprooted by fire in the name of Jesus. You cancer, mention the name of that cancer. If it is head cancer or throat cancer, mention the name of God. Say, you cancer, hear the word of the Lord. Be uprooted by fire. Be uprooted by fire. Be uprooted by fire. Be uprooted by fire. I will not die through cancer. My children will not die through cancer. My father will not die through cancer. My mother will not die through cancer. In the name of Jesus, be uprooted. Your root, be uprooted. Be uprooted. Be uprooted. In Jesus' name, we pray. Amen. Prayer number six. Say, every evil spirit behind cancer. Say, every evil spirit behind this cancer in my body or in the body of my loved ones, come out with all your roots in the name of Jesus. Every spirit behind this cancer or in the body of my loved ones, come out with all your roots. Come out with all your roots. I command you, come out with all your roots. 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 In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Prayer point number seven. See, every spiritual poison projected into my body to trigger cancer. See, every spiritual poison projected into my body to trigger cancer. 
die by fire, 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 die by fire. Every spiritual poison projected into my body to trigger cancer, die by fire, die by fire, die by fire, die by fire. In Jesus' name, they are dead. Amen. Prayer point number eight, the last prayer point for this section one. Say, Oh God, arise and defend my body system against any development of cancer in the name of Jesus. Oh God, arise and defend my body system against any development of cancer in the name of Jesus. Oh God, arise and defend my body system against any development of cancer in Jesus' name we pray. Amen. We are going to section 2, our confession Bible verse for the book of Psalm chapter 6 verse 2. Psalm chapter 6 verse 2. Press and watch it for 10 minutes. Close your eyes. Take prayer point number 9 loud and clear. These prayers are very, very powerful. See, any power sponsoring cancer into my body, receive the arrow of death now in the name of Jesus. Any power sponsoring cancer into my life now or in the future, Receive the arrow of death. 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 In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Prayer point number 10. Say, every spread of cancer cell in my body, I command you to stop in the name of Jesus. Every spread, every evil spread of cancer cell in my body, I command you to stop in the name of Jesus. I command you to stop in the name of Jesus. I command you to stop in the name of Jesus. I command you to stop in the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Prayer point number 11. See, every turmoil eating in any part of my organs be melted by the fire of God. In the name of Jesus. Every turmoil eating in any part of my organs be melted by the fire of God. 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 In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Prayer point number 12. Say, you stranger in my body, I command you to lose your grip over my organs. In the name of Jesus. You stranger in my body, I command you to lose your grip over my life. Lose your grip over my organs. You can measure that stranger. What is that stranger? Mention the name of that cancer. You stranger in my body, I command you to lose your grip over my organs. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Prayer point number 13. Say, blood of Jesus and of God, remove any spirit that wants to introduce cancer into my life in the future. In the name of Jesus, blood of Jesus and of God, remove any bad spirit that wants to introduce cancer into my life now or in the future. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Prayer point number 14. Shout this prayer point loud and clear. Place your right hand upon your womb, upon your belly. Say, you demon of cancerous growth, I bind and cast you out in the name of Jesus. You demon of cancerous growth, I bind and cast you out. I bind and cast you out. I bind and cast you out. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Prayer point number 15. Say, every early sign of breast cancer in my body, die by fire be crushed to death in the name of Jesus. Every early sign or any early sign of breast cancer in my body, die by fire, die by fire, die by fire. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Prayer point number 16, the last prayer for session 2. Say, fire of God, break the yoke of cancer in my life. In the name of Jesus, fire of God, break the yoke of cancer in my life. Break the yoke of cancer in my life. Break the yoke of cancer in the life of my loved ones. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. So we are going to session 3. Our confession Bible fasting for the book of Psalm 6 verse 2. Psalm 6 verse 2. Take this lax section. Take this prayer point very, very well. Prayer point number 17. Say, fire of God, destroy the root of cancer in my body. Say, fire of God, destroy all the roots of cancer in my body in the name of Jesus. Say, fire of God, destroy the roots of cancer in my body. Destroy the roots of cancer in my body. If you know that you have a fibroid, pray very well. Fire of God, destroy the roots of cancer in my body. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Prayer point number 18. Say, all stripes of Jesus, heal me completely in the name of Jesus. All stripes of Jesus, all stripes of Jesus Christ, heal me completely. Heal me completely. Heal me completely. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Prayer number 19. Say, every attempt of the enemy 
to kill me or my loved one through cancer fail woefully by fire in the name of Jesus. Every attempt of the enemy to kill me and my loved ones through cancer fail woefully, fail woefully by fire, fail woefully by fire, fail woefully by fire. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Prayer point number 20. See, every dream of having cancer, I reject it in the name of Jesus. 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 In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Prayer point number 21. So, oh Lord, do not give cancer the chance to grow and spread in my body. In the name of Jesus. So, oh Lord, do not give cancer the chance to grow and spread in my body system. In the name of Jesus. Oh Lord, do not give cancer the chance to grow and spread in my body system. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Prayer point number 22. So, let the blood of Jesus purify and cleanse my system from any growth of cancer in the future in the name of Jesus let the blood of Jesus purify and cleanse my system from any growth of cancer in the future in the name of Jesus in the name of Jesus begin to pray that prayer point let the blood of Jesus Christ purify and cleanse my system from any growth of cancer in my body in the future in Jesus name we pray amen prayer point number 23 I want to demonstrate this prayer point see I shake my body off from any evil plantation of cancer or tumor in the name of Jesus. I shake my body off from any evil plantation of cancer and tumor in my body system, in my blood system. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. The last prayer point, prayer point number 24. Pray any prayer point as led by the Spirit of God. Pray any prayer point as led by the Spirit of God. I'm very, very sure that these prayers have really, really blessed you, of your help to you, in you. Don't worry. The Lord Almighty will heal you completely. There will be no cancer, no breast cancer again. Just believe. Work on that water therapy and you will come out with testimony in Jesus' name we pray. Amen. And you feel, if you feel that you are having symptoms of cancer, you are having symptoms of cancer in your body, or you have, I don't know, I'm not a doctor, you, you can go online, you can check the early sign of symptoms, you know that you are having these symptoms of cancer, kindly go to the hospital quickly and diagnose yourself. Once again, this is Evangelist Joshua from Lagos.